world's largest exhibition of Cartier jewelry is now at Paris's Grand Palais. The show pays homage to the style and history of the company's iconic founder, Louis Francois, with some of the items on display, including the tiara worn by Duchess of Cambridge on her wedding day, Grace Kelly's engagement ring given to her by Prince Rainier of Monaco, and pieces commissioned by the Duchess of Windsor. We have so many interesting pieces. Uh, actually, there are uh, 600 uh, pieces from created by Cartier and uh, 300 documents of archives. And the most significant are probably the tiaras just, uh, just here uh, because there are characteristics typical of Cartier creations. Some of the oldest pieces on display include 19th century tiaras, which are founder Louis Francois's original works. They were created in his first shop, which opened in 1859, and which went on to become the boutique around which the jeweler built a network of clientele, include affluent businessmen, cinema stars, and royalty. One of the most iconic pieces on display is a diamond and ruby encrusted necklace given to film star Elizabeth Taylor in 1969 by her third husband, producer Mike Todd. We show in the exhibition a necklace uh, of Liz Taylor, a necklace given by uh, one of her husbands, uh, with the film uh, that shows uh, her husband given, uh, given the, the necklace to her. And she was uh, one of the most famous clients of Cartier. Uh, she was very fond of big stones and uh, on, uh, ancient uh, pieces, and uh, that's why it was uh, very interesting for us to, to talk about her. The Cartier exhibition features many of the pieces which helped earn Louis Francois the status of Jeweler of Kings. The show is open to the public through February next year.